Hello, this video is on the um, an addition strategy called the Make 10 strategy and you can use this um, for adding any two numbers. It's called the Make 10 strategy. And we'll start with the most basic um, use of it. We're going to uh, start with adding two one-digit numbers. So let's start with our example of 6 plus 7. We're trying to find out what 6 plus 7 is equal to. Okay. So the way the Make 10 strategy works is we're trying to look at the first add end and ask ourselves 6 and what make 10? So the first step in using this strategy is to know um, all of the numbers that go with um, numbers 1 through 9 that make 10. So 6 and 4 make 10. So the first step is um, to ask yourself the question, 6 and what make 10? And the answer to that is 4. So what you would do is you would uh, write that number below the second add end. And we're going to break the second add end up, and we're going to write a 4 here. Now this number here is always the number that makes 10 when added with the first add end. Okay, so 6 and what make 10? 6 and 4 make 10. And we've taken care of the step number 2. Okay? Then, step number 3 says the number below the second add end and what make the second add end. So the number below the second add end, this 4, and what make 7, the second add end. 4 and what make 7? 4 and 3 make 7. So we write the 3 right there. And this is the rest of the numbers that we're trying to add up with the 6. So as you can see, 6 plus 4 makes 10. So we've already made 10 now. And the last step is to add the rest. The rest is adding 3 to 10. So you get 10 plus 3 equals 13. And that's our missing answer. So you can use the Make 10 strategy to add up two one-digit numbers uh, very easily and quickly. And the strategy really helps you to understand how to add not only one or two digit numbers, um, but multi-digit numbers as well as you move forward. So this is just the start, and there will be more videos on using the Make 10 strategy for when you're adding two digit numbers at a time. Let's try one, one, one more problem. Okay. Let's try five plus nine. Let's do five plus eight. All right, five plus eight equals blank. You don't have to draw the, the actual boxes here or the circles. You can choose what you'd like, or you don't have to draw the boxes at all. Just know that this will be the number that um, goes with the first add in to make 10, and this will be the number that, when added to this number, makes 8. Okay? All right, so our first question is to ask the first add in. The first add in is 5, so ask 5 and what make 10? 5 and 5 make 10. So we put a 5 right here. We've already made 10. And then this one right here, this number is going to, we're going to add the rest. We've already added 5 to make 10 to 5. All right, and then we ask 5 and what make 8? 5 and what make 8? Step 3. 5 and 3 make 8. So then we add the 3, add the rest, the 3 to 10, and we get 13. So that's a quick way to figure out what 5 plus 8 is instead of counting it all out. Okay? Hope you enjoyed and are able to use this and apply it to your basic facts.